Hi, it's Yvonne here, and I'm going to do a very short little video. Uh, yeah, just going to plug my social media in there. If you don't follow me on there, on my Instagram, that is it. It is at Odie the Girl. That is the same for my Poshmark. It is at Odie the Girl. So if you don't follow me on there, follow me on there. It's O-R-E-D-I-T-A-D-R-L. So follow me on there, and I'm going to jump into the haul video because I actually went to the bins today. I wasn't going to go to the bins today, it wasn't in my plans, but my neighbor, I had texted her yesterday about a cell going on, and it was here at a local university, they were going to have like a fitness cell, and it was all kinds of fitness uh, items, so workout equipment, workout gear, shoes, water bottles, yeah, and so I know that's right up her alley, so I texted her about it, and she said, you want to go? I said, yeah, if you'll go, I'll go, so we went, and uh, we didn't, I didn't find anything. She did find some items, so she got them. But we went to the bins, so here's the damage. We did at the bins. It wasn't too much. Um, I, w I spent, a, it was three pounds at $1.49, so it was four forty-seven. Two items for a quarter, so not too bad, not too shabby. Uh, here's one of the items that I got for a quarter there. And that was this chicken soup for the soul CD. It's basically uh, the original artist, so it's basically just love and inspiration of songs. So that's it. Pick that up, and then I got this other item for a quarter, and it's this really nice journal. It's like a pleather, kind of leathery journal, yeah, but it has really nice sayings on it. So when I saw it, I was like, ooh, I'm surprised nobody picked it up, but I'm just going to kind of show it there. I'm not going to read it. You can just kind of see it there. And it's really nice on the inside. It's got really nice um, pages. And this is the brand. The brand is a uh, Ecolo World Traveler. And we have a website too. So yeah. So for a quarter, I was like, that is not at all bad. So I picked that up, and then I picked up these batteries from Energizer, just because you always need watch batteries, you know. So. I was like, why not? I'll take those. I said, they might fit a watch or something they might have. So I picked those up for a quarter. I also picked up this little hat <laughs> for my cat. I don't think he's going to like it, but hey, just to get a picture of him with it. Uh, picked up another hat. This one was for my father. It was brand new, so I couldn't leave it. It has Texas on it. So, and it was new, there's no dirt on it, but I'm still going to wash it for him. So that'll work. And what else did I pick up? Oh, yes. I found these in the bin that just had been rolled out. They're these little vintage Cabbage Patch little dolls in the little packaging. They're from 1995, though, so they're not, they're not too, too old, but still, they're just cute. So I got those just to put there on top of my... Um, shelf and they came in a little box so I thought it was a foam little box you know how cute is that so I grabbed those and then I grabbed this bag because when I saw it I was like I had been wanting this bag and it just says bendiciones navideñas on it which is basically um, Christmas Blessings with the Bird and the Guadalupe on it. And it is an American Greetings one. They actually have this for sale. They put it out during Christmas and it's $3.99. So when I saw it at the bin, I was like, oh, I've been wanting that little bag. Yeah. <laughs> so I had to get that. Now, the next item that I found was this. And there's stuff inside of here as well. And it is this. I found another uh, kind of sort of caboodle-like case, but this is by Sassabee. And I remember these. These were very popular, and I've been looking for 
uh, a specific one, and it is the one that uh, came out for 90210. 90210 uh, is one of my favorite shows. It was Beverly Hills 90210. And they came out with these boxes, and they had a version of these boxes. And they had, like, a little logo on them, like the sticker logo on them. So I've been after one of those, but I found this one today, and I was like, I'm not going to leave that. I need that. So I just checked it. It wasn't broken or anything. It's just, it's just dirty. It needs to be really clean. So I am going to so use that for something. But, yeah, you open it up, and uh, inside, let's see. I'm having a little bit of trouble here opening it up. Uh, yeah, you open it up, and I've got stuff inside. And here's one thing I found. Let me see. I'll show you right now. I'm just going to kind of get everything out that I found. But you basically open it up like so, and then you lift that pink part out. You can lift the pink part out, and when you lift it out, it shows basically the what's inside. So that's pretty cool. And you can slide the pink part to the back to access the stuff that's in here. Basically. So yeah. So that was pretty neat for, you know, for what I paid. And let's show you what I got. I found this little Bucky sign my neighbor did. So cute. It was originally $5.99 at Bucky's. So it's over here. Bucky's, if you don't know, is a gas station that's locally here in Texas. They're really huge gas stations. You walk in there, you can get all kinds of barbecue food, and, oh yeah, and they have the cleanest restrooms ever. Like, that's their proclamation, is that their restrooms are always clean. So, yeah. So, yeah, I found this, and I was like, I can't leave it. So, I'm going to hang this somewhere, because I love it, and... Uh, she found me this little hat. She said it was a hat, but it's not a hat. It's actually from uh, Login Burger. Here it is. See, here it is. The Login Burger Company. And if you don't know, Login Burger makes baskets, like really expensive baskets, basically. And I think this is something that was gonna that goes like around the basket. But I got it because I figured I could take a picture of my cat with it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I don't think he's going to let me, but we'll see. And what else did I get? Ah. And I found this too. I got this from my mother. She likes uh, these little cases. And this was just a little Mary Kay case for your lipstick. But it's really nice beaded and everything so yeah this was actually inside of the caboodle case so I was like oh yeah I'm gonna grab that so I grabbed it and lastly 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 and I'm gonna take my glasses off for this one I found these mm -hmm. can you see what it says there yeah these were just thrown in the bin like this and I was like oh glasses and because I always look at glass cases just to look at them they're usually empty uh, and I opened it up and I was like oh are those and I was like yeah they are yeah I found these Chanel rimless glasses in there and I cannot wear glasses like these because then I can't see. That's basically what it boils down to. But these are really nice. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, these are really nice. But you know who's going to get these is my mother because I, for one, cannot wear them. Because <laughs> then I can't see. So that's the downfall to me. But all they really need is to be tightened up and they have the... Chanel made an Italy logo here. Now these are vintage, mind you. I'm going to try and cover my face so you can so it can see if it can zoom in, but I don't know if it's going to zoom in. But they do say Chanel made in Italy there. You can kind of see it there. And uh, the other side doesn't have anything. I know sometimes some of these designer glasses have like an actual uh, 
number on the actual lens here. These do not. They're just dirty, but they are stamped Chanel everywhere, basically, that they need to be. And they even have Chanel here on the little thing here. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but they, they are stamped Chanel there. You probably will not be able to see that. I'm sorry. But, yeah, you know, it's kind of difficult to see. But they are stamped Chanel here on the little rim. I can see it. And, yeah. I think they were missing some rhinestones on the front, though, but I'm not sure. But no, I don't think they are. I think they're just dirty. Yeah, they're just dirty, so they just need some cleaning. But they have the Chanel logo there. Really nice. Super, super nice glasses. So, and they have the Chanel stamped here as well. On the little top part there. Yeah, so my mom's going to be happy that I found her these. Yep. These are really nice. I wish I could wear them, but unfortunately, mm, no. Nah. Then I can't see. So that's the downfall of being um, blind and having to wear glasses all the time. <laughs> so, yeah, that's the uh, haul video. I just kind of wanted to show you quickly what I found. But these were definitely the score. And I'm going to keep these. My mom's going to probably want these, I'm sure. So that's it. Uh, that's the video. And, uh, yeah. If you don't follow me on my social media, please do. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.